everyone, welcome back to Emergency 4 with the Kent mod. So if you remember at the end of last episode we had 15 casualties and a serious crash on the motorway. Fun fact for all y'all, um, I did actually record that episode, I got half an hour in, I got everybody, I got all the casualties taken to hospital, I got all of the mess cleared up, and I sat there like a little patient bunny waiting for the next call to happen. And it never came. So it seems something was completely barked. So rather than me just spend, you know, so long just making a video of scene cleanup, because God forbid that seems to be all the Bieberfeld mod is nowadays, and I think what we'll do is we'll come back to have a fresh start. So we'll pump up to fast forward, and we will. Oh, actually, I tell you what, while we're waiting for a call, so one thing that did come up in me head. While we were, um, yeah, while we were um, filming this second um, video, was the fact that we didn't have any of the private medical services floating around, and they they add a nice touch for when it's um, for when it's quite busy. Um, so let's. Um, okay, I think that I think that'll do us. I think that'll do us. So we'll get those guys set up as soon as they arrive. Meanwhile, we'll just go around the place getting some of the blue lights on to save on some much-needed performance. Okay. Oh well. The fire alarm is most awkward. It is where. Do we not have another fire car anywhere? No, okay. What vehicle do I normally take? I normally take this one. I normally, we normally take the Audi. Um, so what we'll do is we'll grab a crew manager because they can reset the fire alarms. Uh, ordinarily I don't bother myself. Ooh. There is a person running amok in the operational area. Ooh. Arrest or neutralize this person and take him away. And don't forget to treat those victims. So we've got shots fired, shots fired, so we're going to mobilize the ARV. We've got Volvo and an Audi ARV team deploying to somebody. Where are they? We're looking for somebody with a gun. I, 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 I don't see anybody with a gun. He doesn't look like he's got a gun. Hmm. So it could be either of them. Let's just let's just try and arrest both. They're reasonably chillax about this. Okay, let's just get you guys up here. Right, so this is this is our suspect apparently. Yeah, okay, and it's showing officers are with them. So we'll release we'll release these guys. Um we have you in here, so we'll get you out to here. I think that's fine. Right, okay. So we'll get you to come and unset the alarm. No. What did you do? Disable the alarm. Right, okay. That's fine. So we'll get your blue lights off. So we'll basically park one here. Park two in here. You, no, you. Just you. There we go. Right, fine. Okay, so alarm has been reset. So we'll just get the rest of these parked up. And what a surprise, another fire alarm. doesn't really overly matter that these guys can't get out. I don't expect them to be needed with 
all too much immediacy. And um, speaking of immediacy, we do have one detained person. Um, so what we'll do is we'll head out to the popo. And we'll grab grab a station van here. Why not? And we'll get them taken off to the scene. We can get these guys stood down. So we'll blues off. You guys can come park back at the base. Boop. Okay. Fine. Um, I don't know where the second fire alarm was, um, but we're just going to leave it for the moment. Oh, you should probably have your bullets off, eh? Okay, there we go. Right, so, all our medical services are in position. You're going to go get booked in. Okay, so now we'll get you guys with your blues off and to park back here, which we can't actually do at the moment. Because we're still waiting for the other unit to arrive. Hmm, okay. Uh, we'll get you here for just now. Perfect, right, okay, so we've got one in custody and our ARVs are returning to base, which is fine. I don't know where the second fire alarm is. It's here. It's fine. Everything's under control. We don't need to keep responding to fire alarms. They are just a pain in the ass um, in the game, so we won't bother. So, that's the... Oh, no. You are the other AR. So, we want you to come park here. Boop. Okay. Alright, good stuff. So everybody is sorted. This person is away to the Gile cell, which is fine. So we'll get you set to park up over here. That's all fine. Attention, oh my. rioting civilian. Arrest and remove. If necessary, treat any casualties and take them away. 10-4. Uh, where? Okay, they're quite easy to find. So we'll just split up the beeps. We'll grab these two guys on. Um, their normal duty. There might be injuries, so what we'll do is we will get you with a medical bag just in case. And we'll get you heading over to the scene. Oh, yeah, 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 there is indeed. Oh, they're making off, they're making off. No, they're getting arrested. Okay, perfect. <laughs> okay, so one in custody up at the Kent Festival, um, which will mean that we require an ambulance, so we will. Just read you ahead, and we'll get one of those to come on it. Oh no, wrong way. So we want them up here. Perfect. So one casualty with minor injuries following an assault. Um, we're still waiting on the actual suspect. The ambulance is on scene, I'm pretty sure we can just convey them right to hospital. Which is going to free up, free up everyone else. Okay, great. So everyone is alive and well. Um, you're ready to get taken off to custody. You're ready to get taken off to hospital. That's fine. Okay, wait, what? Oh, shit, son. Um, where's our medic? There's somebody been hit by a damn train. Okay, that's problematic. What train line is the one that we use? I think... Because only one train is actually in use, I think... Attention, there are reports of a fire, probably caused by a discarded cigarette. Extinguish all fires. Okay, we need to mobilize these guys first. Um, okay, the air ambulance is quite close. I want you to get onto the tracks here, because I suspect it's this one that's used. Okay, they're supposedly quite well flatlining. Uh, we have reports of a fire, so oh, there's no there's no computer in this fire station, is there? So just picture in your head a turnout alarm going. So we'll basically get one, two, three crews into here, and who's the watch manager? Watch manager is going to be first away if I can find. Person. WM, here we are. Right, okay. Actually, wait, hang on, we screwed up. Okay. 
So it's a fire caused by a discarded cigarette. We don't strictly know what it is at this time. Right, okay. Oh, crap. Right, okay, we've got it back. No, 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 cancel that. Right, you need your engine on. Uh, so here's the building that is on fire. Let's go. Um, okay, so you guys are going to come get fire hoses. You are going to come and get your watch manager uniform on. And I need to know because somebody just came out of it. Can we get into this building? Yeah, we can. Right. I think I think we probably need our second crew. So let's get um, crew manager into uniform, and you guys are all firefighters. So you guys are going to change into uniform. Get the keys. Sorted out here. Okay. Right, let's do this thing again. Right, okay. Let's move! Nope. Engine on. Okay, now having said we probably won't need them for a while, we already need our car and our vans, so we're kind of going to get them up here. Um, the air ambulance has been stood down because uh, life has been confirmed as extinct, we have a fatality on the train tracks. Um, we will just keep off, so we'll stand down the air ambulance crews. Um, so we're just going to wait for the medical services to arrive. Um, right, we need you guys out. So what's going to happen, you guys are going to be our breathing apparatus. Um, right, so you are going to be our safety officer. You, our watch manager, is going to be the incident commander of this. So we're going to get our firefighters to fan out a little bit. We've got a building that's on fire. Um, so these guys are doing outside attack. These guys are going to go in to search for any people that might be inside the building. Because we don't want them around for too long. Okay, crap. Right, get a fire axe. Okay, so we're going to break in the old fashioned way. We have a report of pickpocketing. The thief has escaped. Arrest him and take him away. Uh, that's up at the port, so we'll let port police handle this. Okay, door's broken, so let's go get this in. We'll put the axe back. Any sign of any people? No. Okay, building is clear, so what we'll do is we'll go out and get fire hoses and we will hook up for an inside attack on this building. Uh, okay, our person is now under arrest over there. He is not particularly happy about it. And the coroner has arrived. So I do just want to double check that the barriers are not down. They're not, so we're safe to recover the casualty. So I don't quite know what happened, if that was a suicide or a tre just a suicide attempt or if it was trespassing or something, but oh well. Um, the deceased is now recovered. Uh, we'll best get this police van back to where it belongs. Right, so you're going to take your casualty away. Uh, the fire's still ongoing, so we're going to get the BA crew in here. And you guys are going to come in for an inside attack. Okay, so you're coming inside. No, inside, 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 inside. Come on, get inside. Okay. Well, we've got one person inside. Apparently, that's all we're getting. See, so, I. I Aha! Fire sign. Right, okay. Oh, one second.
sorry about the board break. Um, I had a parcel to collect while I was in the middle of recording, which was Bomber a smidgen left. awkward. Oh, the bomber is fleeing. Arrest yeah. and take him away. You um, also need to extinguish all fires and, if necessary, treat any casualties. Right. What we need is ordinance. Who are shit? Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Here they are. Right. Okay. Ordinance. So the ordinance are going to come on out. Uh, I don't think we can catch the bomber because we don't have armed units nearby. Where is the bomb? Okay, it's by the bins. Um, they're all still full of people. Right, okay, that's fine. Uh, there's no way, no, there's no way in hell I can get there, so I don't think I'm going to be able to try. Ordnance are on scene. It's about whether or not we can get the bomb done in time. So all the people have sensibly moved out of the way and also sensibly not moved into the tracks, which is the main thing. So, is our ordnance officer going to be able to get the bomb under control? Yes. Okay, great. So disaster was averted. Uh, the suspect got away. There wasn't really going to be a great deal that we could have done about that, but that's fine and dandy. So, um, let's just... Now we've got somebody missing. Oh no, not this. Oh no, here we go. Right, that's fine. That's fine. Right. Okay, you guys are gonna decant your breathing apparatus. Everyone else is just gonna don into the fire engine. So you're going to get your shutters down, your blue lights off, you're going to come park in base. Go! Uh, okay, right, let's just get you guys into base as well. So the doors are closed and we'll get you Attention. parked in base. Attention, an incident of shoplifting has been reported. Oh, the thief is escaping. Arrest and take him away. Well, I think we can manage that one. Let's uh, get ourselves some patrol units. So where is the person? I think this is them. Because they're the only one running. Um, bomb scene secure, everyone's fine. So we'll just get these guys back down to base. It's a bit strange that they don't have a park at base function, but sure, whatever. Um, so... That right, guy's running around the place. Police are rushing to attend the fire. Oh no, wait, what? It blows off. Just slurp. If you can't make it there, just slurp. Come on. We totally believe in you. Where are you going? Okay. Right, fine. So he's making a dash for the edge of the map, that much is for sure. There we are. Alright, okay. So the police are gently convincing him to come quietly. You're ready to go off to the Popo station. And you're ready to go to the Popo station. Excellent. So our local B officer has managed to secure our casual uh, our arrested person, which is fine, and all our fire units are back in base. So what we can then do is get them to go and change uniform. It's easier to do it. See, I would do it in the locker, but it's um, it's quite easy for them to get stuck if I do, so it's, uh, I'll probably just end up using the car. Um, so you're going to get changed, and you are going to get changed. So you guys are all Attention. firefighting. Rising civilian, arrest and remove. If necessary, treat any casualties and take them away. Um, where, 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 what, there, what? Uh, okay, they're in the corner of the map. It's going to be quite a wee distance away. So what we'll do is we'll just grab four units. Just because there's a lot of people involved, this could end up um, requiring um, quite a fair jaunt of first aid. So all those guys are going to go. Um, what's the other thing I was looking for? Ah, yes. Um, so... These are all our firefighters. 
you are a state you're the station manager you are a crew manager so you're gonna come over here you're gonna get changed nope that's not wanted right you get changed to station uniform you get changed to the station uniform perfect okay so we do have multiple casualties and this guy is just attacking people at the bus stop and the police are still underway. Um, so this is a very much an ongoing situation. It's a very much a severe situation. So we're going to notify a fair few people. We've now got three casualties involved. So we're basically going to send. Um, we're going to send equipment support just because there's going to be an awful lot of people that need healing. Um, okay, we're going to have three ambulances coming along that are fully crewed. We're also going to grab a paramedic officer, which is yourself. So you're going to be our incident commander. We're going to get you changed here. And we'll grab two paramedics. Sorry, we'll grab three par No, yeah, two paramedics is probably fine. Okay. So we've got three ambulances. Wait, oh, there was only four to begin. All right, okay, okay, right, that's fine. Um, okay. So three ambulances and an officer. Okay, so we're gonna get them out to the scene that's over here as quickly as possible. There are reports of people being taken hostage in the operational area. Rescue them, and either neutralize the kidnappers or arrest and take them away. Okay, that's uh, not good. Um, where is it? It's all the way down here. Okay, fine. Um, this is this one's usually actually quite easy to deal with, so I, I might I might just deal with it just a little bit cheekily. So we've got our two ARV units. Um, that are responding and ready to go. So we'll just uh, we'll get them round to the scene. Because the guy always hangs out by the door. It's not really like realistic. It's the easiest thing in the world to um, to deal with. Um, to be honest, the biggest problem is actually getting around the parked limousines, which is a dumb problem to have. But it's a problem nonetheless. We'll also take a car to get the guy taken off to custody. That's how brazen I am being upon this day. Um, Okay. So. Okay. You can come here. Right, I don't know where the paramedic car has gone actually. We did send it, didn't we? Oh no, no we didn't, no we didn't, no we didn't, no we didn't. Okay, so these two guys have got changed, but we didn't actually send them. So we'll get them in the Land Rover, uh, and that will probably be fine. What's not fine is we've got a guy who's stuck. Right, let's just get all these guys out. Okay, so you're going to come heal one. You're going to come heal two. Okay, so we've got our officer on scene who's going to come coordinate some of the treatments. We're going to get um, the heart, not the heart, the um, rapid response vehicle out the, all the way over there. Okay, let's just get these guys into the building. Because it's usually the easiest way to just deal with this. Oh, what do you know? We can't! Right, okay, hang on. Right, you come get you. Now then, the rest of you get inside. Come on, fellas. Right, there we go. Okay. So, we're just going to go inside, and we're going to nab the person. No. No. Arrest him. What? That, that was dumb. Uh, right, okay. Anyway. 
So we've got two guys here, they're gonna get medical bags and we're gonna come and assist um so that's fine. So my big concern at the moment is we've actually got a person over here who is um being a pain in the arse. So we, we can't actually get this far into the map. Technically speaking. Roger. Hmm. Oh, actually, I've got an idea, right? If we do send people. There we go. Right, okay. Attention. An incident of shoplifting has been reported. The thief oh. is escaping. Arrest and take him away. Absolutely all kicking off in, uh, in Kent today. Um, anyway, with all of our people under um, treatment, I think this is probably a reasonably good time. Right, okay, uh, here, here's a moment of truth. Yes, okay. So you can now... Right, you can now go to your... Roger. Place, we'll get you with our suspect taken off to custody. We've got three casualties to deal with. Everything is um, in progress at the moment, which is ideal so far. Just now, I'm going to say, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching this episode of Emergency 4 with the Kent mod. Lots of small incidents, but well, except for the bombing, of course, but that all got averted, so that's fine. Um, but yeah, good episode. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.